So now we're doing concentrations in solutions. So there are four different types of concentrations in chemistry. Uh, there is mass percent. There is molality, mole fraction, and molarity. So mass percent is the grams of a solute divided by the grams of a solution multiplied by 100%. The molality is the moles of the solute divided by the kilograms of the solvent, and it's the lowercase m is symbolized by molality. Mole fraction is symbolized with this x, and well, any letter that will represent the moles you're using, and it is calculated by the amount of moles, either the solute or the solvent divided by the amount of moles total. The molarity is supported by the big or large case M and it is the moles of the solute over the moles, not the moles, the volume, the volume of the solution, usually in liters. So, let's do an example. solution by dissolving 50 grams of cesium chloride in 50 grams of water of water uh, the volume of this solution is 63.3 milliliters so the volume is 63.3 milliliters. So calculate the mass percent, molarity, molality, and mole fraction of cesium chloride. So let's use the information given. What do we know about cesium chloride? Well, we know the mass is 50 grams. We can solve for the molar mass. of cesium chloride and it will turn out that the molar mass is 168.358 grams per mole and if we divide 50 grams by 168.358 grams per mole we know that the moles would be 0 0.297 moles as for water we also know that the mass is 50 grams. We know that the molar mass is 18.0152 grams per mole. And if we divide it by 50 grams over 18.0152 grams per mole, we will solve that the amount of moles of H2O is 2.775 moles and we also know that the volume is 63.3 milliliters so let's do the first one uh, molarity so how do we calculate molarity molarity is determined by the amount of moles of the solute over the volume of the solution. So the amount of moles of the solute to be calculated is 0 0.297 moles of CSCl all over the volume of the solution. We know the volume of the solution is 63.3 milliliters over here but usually we calculate it in liters so 63.3 milliliters divided by 1000 gives us 0 0.063 now I'm running out of room so I'm gonna write it here 0 0.0633 liters so 0 0.297 moles of CSCL divided by 0 0.0633 liters 
and this will give us yeah, let me pull up the calculator 0 0.297 divided by 0 0.0633 this will give us a molarity of 4.692 uh, moles per liter now let's do molality now to solve molality we said it would be the amount of moles of a solute over the kilograms of the solvent and we know that the moles of the solute said earlier is 0 0.297 moles of CSCL and the mass of the solvent is 50 grams of H2O but it's asking for it in kilograms so we do 50 grams divided by 1000 and it would give us 0 0.05 kilograms So 0 0.297 moles of CSCL divided by 0 0.05 kilograms of H2O. Let's pull the calculator. 0 0.297 divided by 0 0.05. This will give us 5.94 moles per kilogram. Next will be mass percent. Uh, mass percent is determined by the number of grams of the solute over the number of grams of the solvent. So we know the amount of grams of the solute is. Wow, I screwed it up. All right, forget what I said here. Mass percent. Sorry to confuse you. Um, is the number of grams of the solute over the number of grams of the solution, not the solvent, the solution. So we know the amount of grams of the solute is 50 grams of CSCL. And the solution is 50 grams of water plus 50 grams of CSCL, which would give us total grams of uh, 100. So this will give us um, 0 0.5. And we have to multiply this by 100%. And this will give us 50%. Last but not least, the mole fraction. Mole fraction is determined by the amount of moles of a substance over the total amount of moles. And we're asked to solve the amount of moles of CSCL or the solute CSCL. So we're going to use this as the solute. And uh, we solve for the amount of CSCL, it's 0 0.297. So 0 0.297 moles of CSCL over the total amount of moles. So it's 0 0.297 moles plus 2.775 moles of H2O. So 2.775 moles. H2O. Let's pull out the calculator for the denominator. The total amount of moles is 3.072 moles. So when we divide them, 0 0.297 divided by 3.072, this will give us a mole fraction of 0 0.0966. And that's 
all there is to it. I'll make another example uh, in my next video, probably a little more challenging. And well, yeah, this is concentrations.